Yeah. Oh yeah. Batman. Batman looks like he's been like uh, throwing away, throwing down some pizza rolls. Uh. <laughs> In this one, yeah, man, Some, that, he's had a few years off. Like, oh boy, uh, he's uh, <laughs> not. I mean, I don't. Batman's been sitting for a spell. I don't remember Adam West looking right. I mean, like he's he's looking a little like he was, overly. He's like not barrel chested, like barrel bellied or something, right? I mean, God, he was. I'm not making that up. He right? was he was a little doughy. Adam I Adam think. West, but I mean, do do you think that's reflected here? Like, go to the other costumes. What are the other costumes? The other costumes look like this? There are no other costumes. Okay, great. I'm sorry I lied to you. There's other costumes. Oh, great. We got the anime <laughs> Batman. My favorite Batman. The classic Batman. <laughs> this is the only real Batman. I don't even know where this one came from. Anime? Uh, oh. Oh. Okay, now it makes sense. That JoJo's crossover. <laughs> it was me, Batman. Uh, Batman Arkham Knight. Well, he's got, like, Speedos on. Sure, what's why not? With, what's up with the little short shorts? I don't know, man. Anime's weird. What do you want? You're right. Anime's pretty weird. Uh, I'm going to stick with the default bat suit <laughs> version. 8.03. 8.03, which you get a few hours into the game. What's, what's the one on the, on the right there? Uh, the far right. It's Justice League 3000. Okay, sure. I believe. Might as well pop in here. Oh, oh look That's at that. A, that is a fiery red bat suit. It's like a fucking robot. Yeah. Sure. Uh, and you can take any of these into the game. I like that. That's a cool suit. It's, yeah, it's not bad. So wait, you start with the one on the. You start with the. You start. You start with the this seven one. four three. I guess this you... is the, the the one you end Arkham City with. Okay. And then, uh, more recently in the game, I got this thing. Yeah. Which is pretty good because they give you a bunch of new moves when you get this. Uh, okay. As, as part of the story, uh, a bunch of new moves that slot into a very familiar game. Based on the nine percent you've played of it. Uh, this I, this is an earlier save. Oh, okay. Uh, I, I rolled back a, a couple hours, and also that's like collectibles. That's everything. That's your full game progress. Ah. I'm, I'm like a third of the way through the story this now. Joker, he's got a gun. Oh right, yeah. That uh, so. That's so, not really. So the Joker's in this then? No, not really. Okay. I was gonna mention that. <laughs> I forgot there was a loading screen. Uh, there, there's some stuff you'll see in this quick look that if you are like. <laughs> fucking as sensitive to spoilers as you could possibly be you might mildly care about but it's that sounds like something that you could say before any video of any video yes, game ever that is so about the level that it's at okay so uh, not actually that big of a deal no it's not it's, there's nothing it's not story critical at all okay it's, it's more just kind of some neat little flavor stuff least favorite change to this game uh-huh you now like back toward the camera when you walk back Oh, there's huh. no. You know what? I always liked that about these games that you could just make yeah. Batman like stride toward the camera with purpose. You know, not anymore. It's Weird. A, it's a bummer. Yeah. Uh, there was a certain amount of like walk away from explosions yeah, mentality. Yes, that, totally. Like for instance, if I wanted that to, a like, raw motherfucker like Batman yeah, might do. Yeah. Like if I wanted to just stride away from this chemical factory I just blew up. Uh huh. I could do it, but nope. Now he's just gotta like. He likes to stare at it. He's like admire his handiwork. I did that. Uh, that was me. That's my car. It is your car. It's the. You can even swap. You know what? Oh, I forgot. I should have shown you. You can swap out Batmobile models, mm. and they have the '60s Batmobile in here. Hmm. I should have turned that on. Uh, Batman Arkham Knight is like Batman Arkham City. Okay. If, if they replaced like a third of that game with Batmobile. Okay. That. Uh... Alfred. Analyze the militia forces, troop deployments, equipment, movements. I want to know exactly what I'm You know, I have not played a lot of this game. Uh, I have not played the final game at all, but uh, from what I have played of it in the preview stages, what you just told me doesn't sound particularly great. Uh, it's okay. okay. The, ba the Batmobile is okay. All right. Uh, it's a lot of this. There are an army of tanks. At Ooh. An army of tanks has uh, overrun Gotham. A world of tanks. Yes. <laughs> Arkham City. <laughs> it's a Gotham. It's a city of tanks. Uh, there's a lot of dodging out of the way of, uh... You've got a level one missile barrage ready to go. Sights. Yeah, okay. Right, maybe I'll just turn that on. There. Have a missile. Hmm. Uh, that charges as you shoot stuff. Uh, yeah, you, uh, you spend a lot of time in the Batmobile in this game. Um, and not just getting from place to place, either. Like, they find all, they find some weird ways to weave it into the main story mission design. Yeah, I've definitely seen it Ouch. factor into puzzle solving, basically. Uh... Who did that? You. If you line it up just right and shoot them in the turret, they die in one hit. Hmm. Otherwise, it takes two. 
Um, yeah, you know, like the, the hover tank basically, you know, it, it kind of enables a, an alternate mode of movement. Right. From just driving a car, but then they they run with that to kind of an extreme that I'm not 100% sold on yet in that a bunch of the missions have you going into this mode and then maneuvering through a bunch of really tight spaces like tight air, yeah, yeah. to like get a car it, into places that it doesn't seem like a car should be, you know? Right, yeah. Um, which is what it is. Well, it, yeah, see, it seems like the thing that, you know, yeah, anytime you get in any kind of tight space in a car, in a game, you're fucking bumping into walls and doing your awesome power stuff. Yes. Uh, also, there's this. Hello, hi. I've alerted all air traffic. You should probably kill that guy. Yeah? I don't know, he's giving me the side eye. Mm. I don't think I trust him. Is that Mark Hamill? I don't know, man. Because Mark Hamill said he was done doing Joker voice. Yeah. So I don't know if that was just like some sort of clever pre-Arkham Knight marketing or if he actually quit and that's a sound alike or something. Anyway. That's not real. I've got to go. You Batman's might, here. you might have figured by now. Yeah, because like their whole thing was like, "Hey, the Joker's dead." I mean, right yeah, they, yes, they Jim. showed like the Sony press conference was a big shot of Come on, the Joker scared. being cremated. It's if you remember, last right? Week. Yes. He's been taken. Yes. Okay. So they, yeah. Uh, sorry, last week's kind of a blur. Yeah, no, I, I, you'd be forgiven for not remembering that. We'll get her back. If that was not the thing that stood out foremost in your mind. Well, you know, like the idea of like devoting any time in a press conference to a game that was out the following week was sort of like, all right, I'm just gonna, I'm gonna look over here while that's sure. happening because whatever. Sure. Uh, but yeah, you know, Joker's out of the picture. Scarecrow is the guy now. Okay. Um, he's trying to stop me if you've heard this one before. Set off a fear toxin bomb. Okay. To mess up the city. It seems like something Scarecrow would do. Yeah. Uh, so but they should let him do it because that would make for some kind of interesting looking, some crazy stuff. Sure. Yeah. Um, you know. But uh, the, the stuff they showed at the press conference was actually the very beginning of the game that we had seen in the diner. Oh, right. It's like the, the opening scene. But uh, anyway, yeah, in, in the course of trying to stop Scarecrow, you've kind of caught a whiff of the toxin yourself. All right. And so that's where Big Joker is basically just sort of a figment of your imagination that results from that. Maybe he always was. That's very possible. It's steep. Uh, all right, what am I doing here? So... Sometimes they want you to do combat in car mode, uh -huh. uh, in which case you got to let it just kind of lock on here. So let it get all the way until it locks and you shoot a missile. Okay. Uh, if it were me, I would go in tank mode and just blow these guys up, but it's not an option at the moment. Is it because they're going so fast, or it's, what? I Why? think it's because it's weird. Like, hover tank combat seems like a very uh, cordoned off, like, hey, you're in tank mode now, do your tank thing kind of thing. Yeah. Does that make sense? Yeah, I guess. Like, like if there's, so, let's get more specific, if there are dudes outside because I'll Batman never kills block, people, uh, you have, the Batmobile has, like, a non-lethal mode. Okay. Um, and then that's it. Like, I just used it. it like, I just shot it at that guy. Or no, that's the tow cable. I'm sorry, because there's a tow point right there. Yeah. But it's the same button and the same... Oh god, what am I doing? That's a different feature in the Batmobile. You can grab onto shit and yeah. tow it. Uh, I have to stay in the Batmobile and protect... I'll go that. I'll get to that later. Anyway, the, the Batmobile I have has... to be forced to solve this problem in a very specific way. Also, you can do this. Which yeah. is perhaps my favorite thing about the Batmobile. I don't know, man. I, I yeah, it's like, not... It's, it's, Yes, at some point they need to make this car controllable in a, a very convenient way. Yep. Instead of having you back up, do a bunch of three-point turns. Like, no one wants to do that uh, in a in a combat-focused game. Sure. So, like, I get it. Yeah. But it is a little weird. Yeah, yeah. Uh, that's my mission objective, but I want to see what's, see what's in here. Oh. If you get out of tank mode and hit reverse or something, like, because you're faster that no, way? No, no, that's... I think that must be a later Joker puzzle yeah. that I can't do yet. It's a, it's a Riddler puzzle. Or, or, yeah, or a Riddler, yeah, you're right. Sorry. Let's move this Maybe along. you need to upgrade for dual tow Whoa. cables. That was pretty awesome there. Yeah, there's some rough edges in this game mm -hmm. of that nature. Like, just some... Let's nothing minor, or nothing major, back, you know? There's nothing game-breaking. Yeah, there's just kind of... 
like I've seen a fair number of just sort of ragdoll freaking out or like kind of the glide kick stuff not going exactly like you want it to. Mm. Uh, Sam, hey, I'm Batman. Welcome here. To the yep. Counter, I thought you may like to hear the analysis of the Arkham Knight's forces you requested. What have you got, Alfred? I've sent huh. the Bat Computer to analyze militia presence across the three islands and provide you with a real-time representation of the occupation's strength in each zone. If you complete side missions, this percentage will go down. The island is heavily occupied. Am I right? Yep. Okay. Pretty much. Okay. The roads. Hey, there's 38 tanks on that island. Founders island is the militia there's 48 tanks on... Wait, man, there's nine Cobra tanks. Cobra tanks. A lot of tanks. Also, Why six the fuck watch are there towers. So many tanks. What's going on? Also, six watch towers. Okay. I'm a little afraid of what the towers might imply. Maybe I'll be climbing to the top, scanning stuff. Well, there are only there. towers in that one area, so I'm gonna yeah, guess maybe. maybe not. But yeah. All right. Sergeant. Yes, sir. The extraction squad's down. Take control of the clock tower drones. He's coming. Switching to manual control. I'll stop him, sir. Also, I don't know how to feel about this Arkham Knight guy so far. Hmm. Whoop. Hello. The clock tower surround. More tanks to kill. Let you know what it's safe to head inside. Well, there are only twelve total, so. Yeah. All right, eleven. Do they ever resupply the tanks? Like, no, right? Like, that's almost like a collectible. Uh, or kind what? of. Okay. I'm not sure. I mean, I guess the ones you're killing in the course of the missions are are kind of. Leading that total. Yeah, because it says like threat level up in the corner there. I mean, it seems to imply. Check us out. Yeah, you missile barrage. Okay, two. Who's left? Oh. Oh. Where are you? There are militia troops all over the clock tower, Jim. You'll be safe in the Batmobile. I'll let you know when the area is secure. I'm not just sitting here while you go after those bastards. Yes, you are, Jim. Barbara wouldn't want you to get yourself killed. I'll be in touch the minute I'm done. So yeah, second. it's Scarecrow and Arkham Knight. Okay. They're, they're trying to fuck shit up. And how's the traversal stuff in they took, they up, took up Barbara. here when you're... It's fine. It feels exactly the same. It's all the same. Can you fly as much and do as much to kind of, like... So far, Do you, do you yes. need the Batmobile? Not a ton, as I've seen. I mean, except for, you know, like I said, a lot of the missions require it in, in various ways. Yeah. Uh, but you can... You can just kind of do your thing. I have heard that later on there are times when they discourage flying like this. Mm. Which is kind of a bummer, because that's the easiest way to get around, still. Remember how you could double tap to yeah. grapnel? Mm -hmm. Now you can triple tap to super grapnel. Fucking A. Alright, I'm on board. <laughs> uh, it does look nice. Yeah, it does. It does. It, it's run pretty well. There are some spots on the on the PS4 here driving around in the Batmobile. It gets kind of hitchy, but uh -huh. but generally run pretty well. Yeah, you know. Alright, why don't you level up to get that thing off the yeah, screen? Yeah, sorry. Yeah. This is making me crazy. Alright. Uh, very standard stuff on the, you know, upgrade trees. Mm. Uh, just like the last games. But it looks like you got a whole Batmobile yeah. tree now. Yeah. Batmobile weapons tree. Yeah, okay. more yeah, more more upgrades, but same type of stuff. Uh, you know, they've just kind of incremented everything a little bit. Like, you've got, like, two or three extra combat moves that you didn't have before. Mm -hmm. Like I said, the grapnel was a little faster. Uh, where does Nightwing uh, f figure into this? Because when I played it, it was like... It just became like, hit this button to switch to Nightwing what? while you're fighting. Oh, oh okay, so yeah, you, I've seen some of that. Not with him. Uh, but hopefully by the end of this, if I get far enough... Uh, uh, it seemed like it was like part of a combo. It was yeah, almost like a finisher. Will, yes, you will, you will definitely see some multi-character fighting stuff. Okay. Um, what else have we got in here? Back computer, you know. Riddler challenges. All that, all that mess. Yeah. Uh, but... Uh, it's not safe to enter without taking out the militia troops on the roof of the Oh, you could have told me that before I came up here. Uh, and they just pounce down on them and kill them, right? Yeah, so there's, uh... There's, a uh, The one the one major new stealth thing is the multi-kill takedown thing that you may have seen since you've... Oh. Mm. Batman doesn't seem too sure about jumping down on that ledge. Uh, Let's go over here. All right, he'll, he'll jump down this way all day long. Mm. 
Mm. Okay, so the, the multi-takedown... I need, I need like two to three guys right on top of each other. This might do it. Nope. Don't move. It's interesting to see some of these sorts of setups outside of... Or outside. There we go. Just get one guy. Find another guy. Uh, the third guy. Okay. There you go. And that guy shot you. Ah, he shot you again. You should probably. Oh. It's the bat. It is the bat. You're right about that. See out. Do another multi? Can you hear me? Weird. That guy was just a doctor, man. <laughs> non combatant. Uh, those are medics. They will bring guys back. Interesting. Jim, the or at least I assume they are. I actually hadn't. Uh, I read that in like a, a like an AR challenge description. So I assume that's what those guys do. I haven't yeah. actually seen them do it yet, but... Alright. Get the story business out of the way. No, not this side. Uh, but the combat basics are similar Absolutely in terms identical. of counters and yep, 100%. waving your cape and... Yep. All the buttons do the same thing. Detective mode is yep. still... Uh -huh. It's one of those. Okay. Which is fine, you know. Except, oh hey... What? You doing here? Colleen? Is that you again? Maybe don't answer the door. Oh. Candy grab. Oh, yeah, that's No, oh, you went and opened the door. Oh, don't pass out just yet. Come on. Show a little spy. Rough. Uh, yeah. The Joker says some really. I mean, he's. <laughs> presumably, he's not real anymore. But he says some messed up stuff in this. Specifically <laughs> pertaining to this event. Just wait till your father gets home. He's going to be furious about all this mess. How and later on. It's a fucked up thing to do. The Joker's a real dick. Oh, well. Like, man. <laughs> like, I knew that, but holy yeah. crap. Like, uh, so... Also, this the first time I played through this, it was very uncomfortable watching her lie there bleeding and not know what to do. Not be able to interact with yeah, anything. Yeah, because like, there really oh. is, there's nothing to do but just kind of huh. wait for, yeah. Although it's kind of a neat thing to have the... Oh. oh. Yeah, right? Oh, that's cool. Yeah. I, you know, the series has always been great about the hallucination <laughs> stuff. The Scarecrow stuff in every game has been fantastic. Yeah. And now a front row seat to the main event. You would have thought old Jim Gordon had been through enough. First, some handsome young maniac cripples his daughter. It does sound like Mark Hamill. blaming himself for her being taken. You really should tell him this is your fault, Bats. I'm sure he'll understand. I mean, it's not like you went out and got his daughter killed. Well, not yet, anyway. The night's still young. Hmm. Is he still sitting there? Oh, okay. It's kind of a neat trick. It's, uh, yeah, yeah, that does seem cool, but at the same time, like, if there's a ton of that, it seems like that could get... Like, the Scarecrow moments and that sort of stuff worked really well because there wasn't a ton of yeah, it, you know? Yeah. So it was like a very... This isn't your fault, Jim. A very cool diversion. Of course it is. Like peppering the entire game with it. Grace Seems like it could wear out its welcome a little me. bit. Yeah, sure. Especially, if, like, if there's no revenge to get, you're just, like, listening to the Joker the whole time. It's like, fucking... Like, like he's just in your head, yeah. It hasn't been super intrusive for the most part. Not yeah. not like us. Strong, Jim. Stronger than you realize. 
Yeah, Mr. Mustache. She works for you? This is all your fault. I will find her. Shit. She's my family. My daughter. She's all I've got. Don't, don't, don't just haul off and sock the guy. You. He's Batman. Never. Yeah. Yeah, he can take it. Ah, he knew he had it coming. I'll do this on my own. Fuck you, Batman. <laughs> Stay away from my family. Yeah, the, the little the little Joker hallucination type stuff they peppered in here has been pretty neat. The actual story of Scarecrow's trying to fear bomb the city has been just kind of like, eh. Yeah, well, how about the Arkham Knight himself? Like, yeah, he's also leave. kind of like not... I can't leave here. You figure like the voice disguise thing, like at some point, Oracle. do they reveal the Arkham Knight to be someone? Yeah, they have already heard of. But they've straight up said that. Like Alfred okay. has come on. I the... can't leave here until I figure out a way of tracking Oracle. Oh right, yes. I think that went quite well, considering. Mm. Of course, I wouldn't have told him, but that's why it's so liberating being me. Uh, yeah, like, you know, after the first couple times you meet him, Alfred has straight up come on the radio and been like, he seems like somebody who's got some history with you. Yeah, yeah. So, yeah, it's obviously moving towards something like that. But and then it's to find out what happened to Barbara. <laughs> that would be great. They covered the I have no idea. Like, as a, to, to their credit, like, they've done a good job of disguising it. I don't have a clue have who it might be. Um, this is one of those things, things where it's like, you know, there, there's the lore building. to Batman that I am aware of and yeah. plenty of lore that I'm not. So it's one of those things where... I would never even try to guess because right. it's like a fucking I don't know. There's like a zillion people that Batman has fought over the decades that I've never heard of. I'm sure. So, right. although they said to get away from like Joker and Penguin, yep. they're like um, Two Face. That's about Ice yeah. Man. Sure. No, Mister Mr. Mr. Freeze. Mister Freeze. Yeah, Mister Freeze. That's he was in the movie, the Riddler, of course, the Riddler, but also. Mm, Hans. That's the Arkham Knight. He's got Barbara. <laughs> this is kind of a neat little thing. Confirm which car he took her in. You know, it's just kind of more of the detective worky stuff that they've done before. Yeah. But they come up with some cool little twists. I've confirmed on. that it's this car. It seems a little silly that you have to go yeah. highlight it. Those it's like some hidden picture game. Deep it deep was deep. that one! <laughs> I can program the Batmobile to track their unique tread pattern. It'll lead me right to them. Fucking them out. Seriously, is this just like all bunched up right here because it's kind of a pivotal story moment, or is it this much throughout? Uh, it's hard to say. So where this save is, like they have just introduced the fact that he's going to be popping up like okay. 30 minutes prior. So maybe they're laying it on pretty thick here. So I was going to say this is way like a, this. Uh, like, can you just leave? I think so. I think I could just fly away. Yeah, sure. That's a good shot. Shut up, Joker. I'm out. Womp. <laughs> Take out that street light on the way down. Yeah. Uh, all right. The whole, like, launch out of Batmobile, land in Batmobile stuff is pretty neat. Yeah, it's it's a cool The tire cool. tracks will lead me to Barbara. I cool trick. Batmobile forensics scanner to follow them. Batmobile forensics. Yeah, okay. Car detective mode. Yep. Your car is also a detective. I want the Arkham Knight's name. As do it's, I, it's Kevin. He has presumably <laughs> chosen that title for a reason. Where do you suggest we start? Arkham City. Go through the files of every inmate who was released following the death of Hugo Strange. And Alfred. Yes, sir. They knew about I will say, though, like, uh, uh, the totally separate from the hallucinating Joker stuff. There's some other story things that they've introduced that I, luckily I have to save after all that stuff happened, but I'm like, what the hell is this? Like, you remember the Sony press conference where it starts with the voiceover, it's like, this is how the Batman died. Oh, right, right. Like, they've, they've peppered a, little, a few little things here and there around that stuff, hmm. and it's just like, what are you, what is going on? Huh. So there is some, some stuff in the story that's got some intrigue to it. Oh, cool. The militia have deployed a device. It's burrowed deep into the road. Yes, I see it. Similar devices are uh, across the city. I'll investigate. My car no, will I'll investigate. take this one. Me and my tie will take this <laughs> one, <laughs> Batman. That device. It could be dangerous. Oh wait, actually, I think I have to get out for this. Just go jump on it. That's probably fine. Just jump up and down. 
Yep. Just get right up on and touch the hmm. giant glowing red landmine. It's a bomb, Alfred. A well armored one. Oh dear. In that case, sir, should you really be standing quite so close? I'm going to set up a remote link to the bat computer and hit it with every virus we've got. Once we're hacked in, I can expose the core and defuse it with a controlled explosion. Very good, sir. Though I should warn you that the militia has already deployed a platoon of its unmanned tanks to stop you. They won't. Hey, do you like tanks? Do you like blowing up tanks? That is one of my favorite Batman responses throughout this series, is people saying, like, hey, look out, there's some shit coming, they're gonna try and kill you. And he's just like, nah, yep. we're good. <laughs> like, th that's that's yes. one of the best things. He's, yes, he has, a, he has a great disaffected tone to everything. Like, he doesn't worry about shit. Oh, that was bad. Okay, so it looks like the threat level thing is dynamic and not necessarily a... But just like a de depletable, like, take back the island thing. Yeah. Because now you got, you know, 12 of these things. Yeah, I think, yeah, and these... Oh, God. That, nope. Nope. Oh, yeah. So maybe that's just kind of letting you know, like, hey, in this encounter, here's what you're dealing with. Yeah, I think they, they do spawn them in for these story, story points. Give me my rockets. Ah. Oh, good. I'm out of the mission area. Oh, great. Return to the battlefield. Missile barrage. That's pretty good. Yeah. Although you lose, uh, you lose that meter if you take a hit. So. Right. It's it's the equivalent of the finishers. Yeah. On totally. Foot, right? Totally. So you. Oh. I also got this Vulcan cannon, but I'm not really sure what good it is. It seems like it's more for people that are on foot. Well, no, that's the thing. That's what I was saying. It goes to non-lethal mode when your guy's on foot, because Batman does kill people. So. But it still takes him down, right? No, I mean, no. It shoots like a... It's a complete... That weapon turns into a completely different thing. Like a beanbag gun or something? Yeah, it literally shoots some kind of big, heavy slug thing that just knocks him down. Uh, the bomb's payload is exposed. I can use the power winch to all right. trigger control. Now I get my, my, my tow cable thing. Occasionally, you will rev your engine to electrify stuff. That little needle down there. Mm. Hey, way to go. Yep. You think that's it, Dark Knight? I've got this whole city wired to blow. Yeah, there are a ton of these things for you to find and disarm and do this repeatable <laughs> task. Uh huh. A lot of that in here. It's like the Banjo Kazooie of action adventure games at this point. Oh, is that an informant car? <laughs> Remember that? Yeah. Like the green guys? Yeah. Oh, how, what do I do? Oh, I gotta like, stop it and knock and disable the car and then they'll get out, right? I guess so, yeah, but... Come here, you. I'm trying to get my non-lethal thing to lock on. Maybe I have to... Hmm. It's not seem to be happening. There it is. Oh, weird. Okay, this is different than in the story stuff. Uh, okay. You gonna hop out? Oh, yep. All right. Yeah. Okay. It's the first time I've seen one of these. Come here, you. Look out. It's the bat. Wait. Are you gonna? You wanna fight? There we go. Talk. So yeah, there's this again, you know, you track these guys down and uh -huh. add a bunch of trophies to the map. Yeah. I mean, if anything, there's your tower climbing equivalent, right? Yeah, yeah, sure. Alright, where were we? Yep, this looks nice. Yeah. Uh, which direction are these tracks going? I guess this way. Wait. But the... Tracks are over here. I thought you tracked the tracks to the bomb, and oh, that was I, it. Did, oh, did I make it all the way? I thought I had more. I was pinging more at the end. Oh, I don't know. I'll just go where this tells me to go and see what happens. Why well, think when you have a mission objective? Uh huh. Use the forensic scanner and track the route of the militia vehicle. Okay, yeah, okay so. so now you're back on track with the tracks. Oh yeah, okay. Here we go. Filling in the tracks. Alfred, 
The Arkham Knight's trail leads into Miyagani Island. Lower the Mercy Bridge. I, I can't, sir. We're locked out. The militia must have hardwired into the transport control system. Find me their access point. Right. Tracing the yeah, sure. It seems to have all been rerouted to Grand Avenue Station. Then that's where they'll be. I'll proceed on foot and take over their That's a nice little thing. Like, hey, now you're you're out of the car and up on top of this thing. Yeah. Which you were gonna do anyway. Right. Destroy it. I don't know if I can. You know, Hugo Strange mm, doesn't look like it. No. So, yeah, this is the point where they open up the other two islands and they kind of make the whole world accessible. Yeah. Uh, if I just do this quick little the objective here, you can kind of. The Arkham Knights Militia. Get a better idea of what the full the map, scope of the game is. The point they're using to hack into the transport network. DTV. Oh, Good. We're gonna need None of that multiplayer it's stuff's in this one, right? Not that I've seen. Okay. okay. What had like? Did, was that just in Origins? I think so. Yeah. They were like, "Hey, we came with a multiplayer mode." Well, the city didn't have anything like that, did it? Uh, no, no. Multi takedown. Anybody else? Anybody? Nope. Just getting two this time. Cool. Yeah, it's a, it's a neat little move. Well, that's kind of the one major new thing in the stealth that I've seen, and then, uh... If I get into, I'll, I'll get into a fist fight here in, in a... Oh boy. That's no good. They haven't done a ton of new stuff to the melee combat. There's like one or two new things. Hmm. 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 Where are you going? All right, okay. Oh, so you need to perform a silent takedown in order to do your multi-takedown. Yeah, you just got to get in range. Oh, crap. <laughs> I was just expecting it to give me the prompt to do it, so I hit the button. Oh, well, this got bad. Drones, also? Did they land since I started fighting these guys? I guess they did. They're drones. Okay. Like, just straight up, you know. Drones. Oh, those little things. Drone yeah. drones. Yeah. No, no, like flying ones. Oh, oh, oh. And, like, you'll see in detective mode, like, the li a line tethered to the guy who's, like, operating the drone. Ah. Uh, they seem to have all come down since these guys are on alert now. Ooh, might be able to do this. I'll let me do it. I don't know. Silent takedown. Oh, it wasn't giving me the multi. That's because you have to do a silent takedown to recharge your ability to do a multi. Oh, did it say that? Yes. Okay. Oh. I am in a bad way here. Yeah, that's... Still with the guns. Yeah, fighting guys with guns. Kind of a delicate thing. You yeah. die here. Okay. And your legend dies with you. Yeah. Cool. Remember Batman? Yeah. This is a new Batman game. Yeah, I'll give this a shot. I yeah. don't know. Like the it's cool. It's you know the, the the spots I saw earlier this year and then a year ago, where they kind of had all the Batmobile integrated puzzle stuff uh -huh. was just everything took longer than you wanted it to take because you had to swap to remote control the Batmobile. Yeah. yeah so you know, winch something yep. up, switch back to Batman, like that stuff. There, I, I don't. I didn't like it much. There has, there has been a lot of that in here. Yeah. You just, you just yeah. happen to not be seeing any of it in this quick look, but yeah. there's... Uh, actually, I don't want to drag this on too long. If I can just take these guys out real fast, the, the next mission is that. I feel like we should show a little bit of that. Crawling with the Arkham Knights if I can get through this super quick. I need to clear them just out so people know. Find the access point they're using to hack into the transport Come on, network. get up there. Mm. I don't know what Scarecrow and the Arkham Knight will do to us. 
Uh, let's see how this goes. Yeah, that worked out. There you go, you can see a drone over yeah. there flying around. And so you have to take out the guy controlling the drone, or can you like EMP batarang the drone or I something? I, I, like, like I said, they've all just kind of been dealt with once I got rid of the guy who was flying them. Yeah. So I wonder if you eventually, if one of the upgrades is like double fear or whatever. Like your fear is lit up because you have a solid oh, takedown right, charged right, right, up. Right. So now you can do the multi takedown. Double fear takedown. And now you have no fear. Yeah. So you gotta get fear. You gotta re get a fear up. <laughs> it's very Sam Fisher. <laughs> they still think I'm in there. <laughs> Alright. And you're also re-feared. Yeah. Oh, if I could... Feared. If I could get right above him, I could do the thing. What could happen is it... That's nah, screwed. Wait. Now they think I'm up? <laughs> well, apparently I could just do the laptop and not even worry about these guys? I don't know. Making you look like dead, but uh, no, but not actually yeah, dead. But not for the record. Batman doesn't hurt people. He's a good guy. With the Arkham Knight's men taken care of, I can use their uplink terminal to lower the bridges. Isn't that Barbara's job? Oh, right. In all the excitement, I almost forgot. <laughs> You don't really huh. think old Jimbo's gonna <laughs> Not feeling it? Nope. It's a lot. A garage bat. Yeah, the, the frequency of it, like having it kind of punctuate Alfred, every single sequence the yeah. that I've seen you play so far. Like, it's a neat trick, but yeah. if they lean on it too heavily, that's... Yep. I like what happens to Batman's eyes when he's in this mode. Yeah. Ah! Contact me when you're ready with the bridge. Riddle me this. And they, I, I guess they kind of did this before where they'll like, you know, before it's the Joker, now it's Scarecrow, but they'll, you know, they'll shift the story kind of arbitrarily away from, from that villain for a while. Right, yeah. It's like, ah, now you're going to go deal with the Riddler for a while, even though he's not really involved in the main plot. Yeah, like, do you have the mission wheel? Yeah, so that's why I wanted to open this up, because that'll kind of highlight some of that stuff. Uh, yeah, I've, I've done a little bit of the Riddler stuff. Uh, so they've done a better job of consolidating the side stuff. Um than they did in Arkham City, where I, I kind of felt like it was a little all over the place. Yeah. Here, you basically, here's all your side activities. So right. I've got firefighters to rescue. Uh, Riddler is a side thing, but but at this point, they kind of shove him into the main story for a little bit. Mm -hmm. uh, there's the mines. Uh, I've had some more of these sections fill in since. Right, yeah. And yeah. Uh, and, and there, it's a lot more collectibles, and there's, like, there's, a, there's a serial killer kind of side plot here. That I'm starting to get into, mm -hmm. but like Arkham City, you can't just pursue these as long as you want. Like you can, I was only able to do this first step of the series. Oh, and then it was thing. like, hey, maybe you need to go yeah, interrogate you, some people, or, or, or no, it's actually just in the course of the side of, of the main story. They'll start okay. like yep. gating and opening yeah. the next. Uh, uh, yeah, so uh, the main story doesn't seem That's super long. No mm. I'm like a third of the way through it me. now. But it seems like there's a lot of stuff in here. Yeah. Uh, I think I can just fuck off Riddler. I can go to where I'm going. Uh. Oop.
Yeah. Yeah, yeah. that's a Batman game. Yeah, it seems cool. solid. All right. It seems solid. So uh, this next mission has uh, some of that... Um, the two-character stuff. Yeah. yeah. I'll yeah. see that real quick. I'll pop in here real fast. But, uh... Has he gotten fucked up at all as you've no. been playing? Like, does the suit get tattered? No, so like I said, I got this new suit at a certain point. Yeah. Uh, and it's still nice and shiny. Okay. But also, it's, like, super armored. They go into all this detail about how there's, like, three layers of mesh weave, thermal fluid, something, something. And you think we would be able to fucking handle more than four bullets or something. Yes, you would think. Also, more of this. Man. Man. <laughs> I don't know, man. There's a lot of it. Oh, hey, hi. Okay, like, I I'll, guess, like, whatever. You can just kind of keep going and not listen to his dumb ass, but, like... Yeah. So that's the the, ma the biggest new combat move. If you tap in the direction of a guy as you counter them... Uh-huh. Uh, well, I can't do it to two, but... It's this cool flash, and you basically throw them. Instead of, instead of just countering like that, you'll kind of... Knock him away and get but some do you, distance. Do you want? You don't want to do that all the time because you probably want to keep some of the guys close to you so you can kill them, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sometimes, yeah, like in a big crowd, it's it's helpful. Um, I shouldn't have done a takedown on the informant guy. Eh, whatever. There will be plenty more like him. Yes. And this isn't your real save. Yep. Batman? That had better keep still. Stop talking and just let me rescue you. Are you okay? Perfect. What little girl doesn't dream of being bait for her strapping dark night? Uh -huh. We're leaving. You might be, but I'm not. Ah, both contestants are finally here. Tonight, folks, we've got riddles galore. Riddle, riddle. But first, hmm. let me introduce my beautiful assistants. Ah, I'm growing tired of my dependence upon the least useless dregs I can scrape from... And then the, the thing after this, I'm sure you saw in previous stuff, I saw some of it, was the... The Riddler, like, Batmobile courses. Yeah, yeah, uh... Doing this opens up more of that. And that's where... didn't seem... That's where a lot of the, like, you know... Get the Batmobile across this chasm, but then get out and remote control it, because you have to go stand on a switch elsewhere. There's, like, oh, that's where oh. a lot of that stuff comes in. Uh, which, some of it is kind of satisfying in a puzzle-solving way, but some of the stuff that you do with the Batmobile in the, in the mission design is not yeah. the best. Yeah, this dual team takedown stuff, I thought looked really cool. Yeah, it does. Like, you get yeah, stuff like that's that. that's cool. Yeah. Uh, now I'm playing as Catwoman. Mm -hmm. What a pair you make. Together, you're just oh. competent enough to survive. Enjoy it while it lasts, Dark Knight. I have more in store for you than hitting things. Don't feel left out. Take that, stupid robots. Yep. Uh, how about this, like, quick fire explosive gel stuff and uh, some of the battering and combo stuff? Is it's, that... it's basically all the same. Like, you, if you if you ever really did, like, the, the, the kind of outside the game combat challenges in the last games, yeah. uh, it's all exactly the same. Okay. Like, the challenges that would be like, you know, use all of your moves in a single right, free right. flow combo or whatever. It's, it's, you know, you got your cape for blinding, you got the quick Batman th or Batarang throw. Uh, this one's for you, Daddy. Take down on this last guy. Um, and then, uh, I, I can't access this here. They've moved all those combat challenges into the world from what I've seen. Oh, hmm. They exist as like AR challenges now rather than just going to a menu to do all the combat challenge stuff. Uh, anyway, yeah. Okay, this game's all right. Yeah, it looks looks good. Some of the some of the Batmobile stuff not not my favorite, but other than that, you know, like it's it's solid. Yeah, it's I guess a lot of it comes down to ratios, you know, like yeah. how much of the game really is Batmobile, like how much Joker there is. Yeah, is something yeah, yeah. That I, you know, I personally would not want that much more of it. Right. It just seems like one of those things, like, hey, you know, you're, you're kind of fronting this whole thing as like the Joker's been dealt with. Like, don't lean on him. As a total crutch. I guess so. That way, but just to keep a popular character in your game. Yeah, but at the same time, like I said, the kind of the the, the, the A plot of Scarecrow bombing the city has been super kind of predictable. Yeah, yeah. And not very interesting. Well, maybe um, it'll pick up. So I honestly, I feel like putting the the Joker stuff and then the other stuff I mentioned earlier, vaguely. Uh, Good work. 
I'll contact you. Is kind of helping to spice that stuff up. So we'll see where it goes, but uh, I'll. Uh... Well, oh hey, man, old boy, this man. Is where'd you come from? Uh, isn't it? Do you <laughs> save the incompetent friend who got herself kidnapped? Oh, this is the part the friend who got that I was talking about earlier. Just some of the shit that comes out of his <laughs> mouth. Go see Eddie's latest contrived death gauntlet. I'm sure he went to a lot of trouble. It's kind of gross. Besides. You can't save all of Barbara. I killed half of her already. It's fucked up. Yeah, you know. You're a real asshole, Joker. That's his thing. I guess so. Thought he was all about laughing and mirth. Yeah, that's that's a funny goof. Uh-huh. Yep. Right? That's so... <laughs> Ugh. Uh, yeah. This game's pretty good. But, you know, very familiar. Yeah. Cool. Well... Uh, and it'll be out pretty soon. Like, tonight? Yeah, tonight and tomorrow. Cool. All right, thanks. All right, see ya.